Hey everybody, friends and family, just letting you know that um, I successfully survived, um, I don't know what it was. Um, a pummeling. A what? Pummeling. A pummeling. A pummeling. I survived it. Tina survived it with me. Um, I'm not sure how we both survived it, but the Atlantic Ocean just whipped our asses. Um, so we are trying, Bella's with us on our little trip and we're trying to be more kid friendly, you know, cause we're older. She wanted to go out and swim. So we were like, okay, cool. We'll go with you. Our biggest concern and worry was, um, how cold the water was, right? That shouldn't have been our biggest concern and worry. We, we quite frankly should have been concerned and worried about the tide that is very strong. And so... I even said to Tina, as we're going down through there, you think we should take our hat, our hats off, our pretty, look, this is this looks like a sombrero now. Um, well, it's been dunked. It's been dunked because my head was dunked and my hat fell off my head and Tina had to rescue my hat and her hat, let's take a look at her hat. Her hat, I don't even... Mine looks like a bonnet at you're, this point. Yeah, it's you're starting to, look, starting to look like a bonnet. <laughs> so we decided, no, we got this. We can get out there in the ocean and swim with hats on and, and look cute. And so uh, we did it and uh, failed miserably. Um, my, my really cool hat, I don't know if it'll dry right now. Tina didn't lose her hat, but it is now warped and kind of goofy looking. <laughs> she has a knee injury. We got knocked down. And of course, what best friends do is we grab a hold of each other as the ship is going down, right? Hold on, hold on tight. Well, when one rolls, they both roll when that happens. When you have a hold of somebody and you're not letting go, um, you tend to roll together. And at some point, the tide separated us and we were both on our own fighting for survival. And Tina got to her feet first, but she had a knee injury, um, road, road rat, well, it's a seashell rash. Yeah. Um, she was dragged across um, shells in, in the Atlantic Ocean. By several waves. <clears throat> By several waves. Um, I went down, not without a fight, but I went down needed a life alert to say you know help a fall and I can't get up <laughs> because literally I couldn't get up like every time I got ready to get up another wave came crashing on me from one direction and next thing you know the next wave is coming the opposite direction and I was as Tina indicated pummeled um, fought a valiant fight tried really hard to look cool under pressure um, failed miserably failed failed miserably <laughs> failed miserably um, Bella who wasn't willing to swim alone is now willing to swim alone without us anywhere close to her <laughs> and I really can't blame her because we're the old chicks with our chubby butts sticking up in the air as the Atlantic Ocean sweeps over us around. and uh, there you have it. So, uh, we survived. We survived. Um, great vacation. Great vacation so far. Um, getting your tail end whipped. Knee injury. Messed up my beautiful hat. Um, now it looks like a sombrero. Um, no longer can be cute until I buy a new hat um, at the beach. Tina's going to do something with her hat. Because uh, hers got wet too. Yeah, it did get wet. Nice. Yeah, so hers is wet and that's why it flopped. So anyway, um, we have some extra special stuff while we're on vacation and doing girls time together. So you guys uh, keep a watch out for, uh, is that right? Keep a watch out or an eye out? Keep an eye out for more to come. Keep an eye out for more to come. She's going to be my executive producer from now on. <laughs> so... Uh, we got some fun stuff planned for the weekend, and um, we're being safe. We're making sure that no one is anywhere close to us. We failed at the safe already. Well, we failed at the safety <laughs> in water.
That that was a failure, I agree. <laughs> yeah, it kicked my ass. But so far we're winning at the um, coronavirus isolation thing. We don't have anybody near us, no. probably because they're afraid of being associated with us. Right. Because we are the weirdos. Yeah. Um, who scream with a southern twang to help them. And you know what? That kid lifeguard didn't come help. He didn't. He's he just didn't. Pan over and show him just chilling. Show him, show him just chilling. Yeah. See, he's chilling. He's chillaxing. So, yeah, um, good times in Virginia Beach. We'll be home soon, but watch for some more videos because we have some fun stuff planned. Um, Tina's now having to nurse her wounds. She's got swelling, localized redness. <laughs> What else is, what is, I'm learning medical terminology because I work at the clinic now. Yeah. Um, she's got some bleeding. Some abrasions. So technically open wounds. Just abrasions. Just abrasions. But the problem is we have only one Band-Aid and I suffered a toe injury earlier today. <laughs> so I don't know. I don't know if we're going to <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if this is going to be possible. So, um. We aren't going to be here long enough for anybody to send us band-aids. Don't worry about that. You don't have to go through that. No. Um, we'll wrap paper towels around ourselves That's or something. Right. May need to go to the dollar store and get us some bubble wrap. We have and lots of ice. We do have lots of ice, so maybe ice will work. Okay. So, wanted to let you know we are safe, alive, in Virginia Beach. Injured. We, injured, but, but, alive. but alive. So, we're checking in as alive, injured. But having a heck of a good time. Heck yeah. In Virginia Beach. Okay. We will talk to everybody soon.